Hi there, this is Maria Palazzolo with St. Louis Golf Lessons. Thanks for joining me today. I had a student the other day that had the question, she wanted to know what's really the difference between chip shots and pitch shots, and what clubs should I use for both? And that's a fantastic question. I think a lot of beginners wonder that. However, I've had players that have played for 30, 40 years that actually don't know the answer to that question. So I'm gonna to try to give some insight into that. So first off, a chip shot is a very uh, close in shot. It's a very low shot. So this area here, I'm um, just a few feet off the green, maybe back to 10 or 20 feet. I'm going to be chipping. You know, my goal here is to keep that ball as low as possible, keep it out of the wind, keep spin off of it, try to get that ball on the green as soon as I can and let it just roll up there like a putt. So because I want to keep the ball low, I'm usually going to use something like a pitching wedge or even down to a seven iron, maybe even a hybrid. So there's a lot of players like to chip with their hybrids. And that's that little stroke that we do where it's very pendulum like, like putting. We don't have a lot of wrists going in. We don't have a lot of weight shift. We're simply trying to run into that ball, bump it on the green and let it run. A pitch shot now is when I'm further off the green and now I've got more to carry. So I've got to elevate the ball. I've got to hit it higher. Well, since we want loft, we're gonna use wedges for that. So typically your sand wedge, which is my favorite, you could also use a gap wedge or a lob wedge. And a pitching swing is gonna get a little longer. We're gonna get some wrist angle in there, get a better angle of attack, get some leverage, pop that ball up. We might even be going back to here if we're trying to hit about a 50 yard shot and we're simply gonna match that on the follow through side. So there is definitely a difference between the two. So you gotta to think to yourself, do I wanna keep this ball low and get it on the green quickly? that I need a less lofted club. If I need to hit it up higher, I need a more lofted club. If you have any questions, you can feel free to leave them in the comment box. Be sure to follow St. Louis Golf Lessons on social media and share our videos with your buddies. We'd appreciate it.